A ski jump is perhaps the most symbolic of sporting attempts to defy the forces of gravity. The design of the ski jump at Garmisch Partenkirchen aims to reflect this. It's the work of architects Lernhardt and Meyer. The interesting thing about the project specifications for us was the line, the gradient, which is a technical necessity for the sport, but which also has a certain aesthetic quality in itself. We attempted to find ways of subordinating everything else that's needed to this sporting aesthetic, or even to exaggerate it, to enhance it. The gradients of the ski jump are the angles of inclination for the in-run, the takeoff ramp, and the height of the jump itself. The architects translated these angles into a dynamic steel structure. The jump tower is 100 meters long and 62 meters high. Despite its size and monumental character, there's a certain lightness about it. The steps and entire support structure were integrated into the overall fluid design, which blends into the surrounding mountainscape like a work of art. We've tried to find a structure that is, in principle, just a constructed slope a line that adheres to the ski jump line, but that continues upwards and doesn't end with something that puts the brakes on this sense of movement. Instead, you've got something that makes you imagine the skier's movement the other way around, like a starting ramp. The architects pitched their design against a number of famous international competitors and won the commission. This is what the old ski jump from the 1950s looked like. This was how it was assembled, actually lying on the slope. And then it was pulled down here, thereby slowly erecting the jump. The planning phase was meticulous in its attention to every last detail. The architects joined forces with civil engineers. I think this will be one of our milestone projects. You don't often get the chance to build a ski jump. You're more likely to be designing residential buildings. In fact, you'll probably only ever build one ski jump in your whole life, if at all. After an eight-and-a-half-month construction period, on December the 21st, 2007, the ski jump was officially opened with an inaugural leap by the German youth champion Felix Schoft.